hey guys welcome back to my channel so today um by the way how are you doing i hope you're doing great i hope you're keeping safe i hope all is well with you and your family so today uh, so if you are wondering what i'm talking to i'm talking to my little boy he's there so today i want to do a video that this video has been long requested by someone for me to show what i typically cook like what is my what does my african grocery haul looks like i already made a video of where i shop that was also requested where i buy my stuff so now i want to show you some of those things that i buy most times when i go to the african shop like i must have them at least every month they're always in my african grocery store least so if you're interested to see them this is just a video for entertainment maybe it's going to inspire you to want to cook different meal so let me quickly say this i'm a cameroonian if you're watching me for the very first time i mean my cameroonian traditional dress is called kaba and i have my hair wrapped in the african fabric i'm everything african i have my bare face here so please don't come for me this is my bare face but everybody we must not wear makeup every time anyway that's an outside so um, I just wanted to say that I still eat as if I was in Cameroon. I don't do Oibo food. I do once in a while for my kids, but for me, I still eat as if I'm in Cameroon. I'll show you guys the stuff I got and then I'll kind of give you the prices. I also try to, to convert them into safer at the end of the video so you can have an idea of how much it can cost you to eat African food. In this part of the world and i do shopping like this sometimes twice a month sometimes once a month depending on how i eat <laughs> it's a month that i eat a lot i will do this two times a month that i don't eat so much i can do it one and a half time okay so i'm going to start from this side i got a pack of dessert this cost me three euros it's expensive but you can also buy this from the normal obudu Ibo shop so i got this pack of dessert that cost me three euros. Um, oh! And then I got some plums. I have six here. I think I got a total of 12, I think, for six euros 50 cents. That is already more than that is almost 4,000 CFR for 10 plums. But I gave some to somebody because these are things that I buy when I see them. I don't buy every time, I just buy when I feel like eating. And so the next thing I get that I always get when I go to do my African shop grocery is fish. I always buy fish and I prefer this one. This is, we call it mackerel. Some people call it um, Thompson. But this is it. Let me show you guys how it looks like. This is my favorite kind of fish. Sometimes I buy bar. But I like this one because I cook a lot with this particular fish, type of fish. So I got two packs of this, which I think this two is around maybe already like uh, 12 euros, I think. But I'm going to check out inside them on the screen. And then I have been craving um, grilled tilapia, so I got one big tilapia. Also, I got um, a pack of hot chicken that has been chopped already. I think this one is 3 euros 50. And then I got meat with bone. We buy this one also. I got meat. This is with bone. Yeah, because I'm African. I like to chew bones. <laughs> so I got this. And this is 3 kilos. Some grams. This cost me 20 euros. 19 euros 80 cents. So this cost me like 20 euros. That's a lot of thousands already. So I got plums. And then I got pepper. Just mix yellow and ripe pepper. I got ginger. This is ginger from Africa. I got ginger right here. I got a bag of gari because I'm more of a gari person. And this is from Ghana. Yeah, Cameroon has the best best gari, but unfortunately, our gari does not come in a big sack like this. So I went with our African sisters or brothers, their own gari, Ghana gari. My Ghanaian people, now they are the to promote on a product. So, and then I got this rice also from there. This is. Thai rice or whatever rice I got it from the African shop. Then I got Maggi. I got two types of Maggi because there are two different flavors. This one is Maggi Crevette, and I love to use it when I'm cooking stuff, vegetable, anything vegetable, Eru, especially Eru and Dole. I love to use the Maggi Crevette and not this one. This one is the normal seasoning cube, but this one is Maggi Crevette and it's from the brand Maggi. This one is from the brand Maggi as well. 
so i got that two of these i think one this one was about three euros fifty this one yeah three euros fifty three euros you should see that three euros fifty or four euros fifty and then i also got peanut butter because i love peanut butter this one i used to make granola soup this one cost me two euros sixty five cents and then i got some palm fruit that has been mashed mashed palm fruit this is to make my banga soup i have a recipe so i'll be making banga soup and pack of cocoa. so that is why over here i have cocoa yam this cocoa yam i have in here five <laughs> Five normal sizes of cocoa yam and this cost me seven euros and then over here i have plantain i have like six because my my kids don't eat plantain except if i make it in except, except if i make what we call sesep plantain i have the recipe on here so i'll link it below that is when my kids eat plantain so plantain is normally for me i don't buy too much my kids they love to swallow i also got some smoked chicken from there i don't know how much this was but i'll look on my receipt i'll insert it on the screen and then i got a pack of our peanut because it's just so tasty i love this sometimes i just like to grill it and eat as my snack so this is not for soup it's for my snacks you can you grill this and drink gary with it or drink gary with it raw like this is very yummy they don't have the left bite and come and say i'm responsible for it please no i'm not responsible for it the next thing i got is arrow before i come to this one I got arrow. This is good. I'm going to cook this like two times. My kids, they love arrow. And then I got also this special pepper. This is a very special pepper. If you want to cook arrow, very, very good. Very good. If you want to cook your arrow and you come across this pepper, buy this pepper. It gives your arrow an extra flavor and an extra taste. Different from when you use this one. So I got that because I'll be cooking arrow. Over here is my kids' favorite okra. So I got a big bag of okra. A big bag of okra. This I think this cost me almost 10 euros. That is about 6,500 for this. <laughs> if it takes 6,500, say you want to go buy okra for market for Mutenge no or Kumba market or Fiango market, you know how much okra you go buy. So this cost me 10 euros something. That is 6,500. I think. And then I got palm oil. See, I say this. I got palm oil, and if you've been watching me for a very long time, my cooking videos this is the only oil palm oil I use from Cameroon. And it's from a company that I love so much. It's from CDC. It's from the Southwest. So this is the only palm oil I use. I have also tried the palm oil from Ghana. I think it's okay, but to me, my favorite palm oil is this one. It's not sticky in the tongue. It has no extra smell. So over here, I got some pack of beans because I want to prepare corn chaff. So I got two packs of prepared beans some other time, and then another pack I use for corn chaff. And this cost me two euros seventy-five cents. I got two. I think I've already showed this one. Then I got rice. So basically, that's all I got, and everything on this table, excluding the beef. Everything, including the beef, cost me 136 euros. The beef cost me 20 euros. So if I add that, so everything here cost me 156 euros. If you convert that to CFR, that's a lot of shopping money in Cameroon. But what can we do? So that is it, guys. That's what I got. And this is what I typically get. Every time I go to the African shop, I must get okra. I must get plantain. I will get cocoa yam if I see cocoa yam. If I don't see cocoa yam, I can get the other yam, like the white yam. But plantain is always present. Pepper is always present. Aero is always present. Okra is always present. Fish is always present, present because I'm more of a fish person. So my kids, they eat beef because they like to swallow. So I make soup for them with beef. I'm more of a fish person. So yeah, so that's basically all I have for my African. Uh, grocery haul that's that's it that's it guys so let me know if you enjoy this with this uh this video this short video for my plantain i'll be using it to make pool fish in pool fish i'll be using the fish i showed you guys that's why i got plantain and then the other part of plantain i can use it to make a little bit of sese plantain and then i got cocoa yam because i want to make kwa cocoa and banga soup and then i also got eru with the era of making eru i have all the recipe on my channel Okra, I'll be making okra soup, plain okra soup, and also a goosey okra soup. My kids will eat with fufu. And then the pan food that I got, the Ghana Fresh that I got, this one is from Banga Soup. This one, I'll be making granola soup. They'll eat it with rice. 
so like before i go and buy i already have everything every res um, recipe that i want to make in my head and all these recipes i just mentioned i have them on here on my channel so feel free to check them just go to my video list and check on cooking series and all the videos all the recipes you are going to see them there so i wish you guys a blessed day and a blessed week and i'll see you guys in my next one let me know if you enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed it the way to show me is to give me a thumbs up guys my skin can you guys see my skin skin can you see my bed my skin can you see ah. bye guys Mwah.